Luniston. Hills ridge and buckle northwards, and I ridge and buckle too, stumbling on burnished bracken, a small sacrifice inelegantly made in time of need. Little blue butterflies lap around my feet. I did not know that they might live up here. The world is sometimes good. The creamy cotton grass bows its many heads as one, respectful of the stern-faced Sunday men who strain to put a Christian face upon this mountain. Staggering beneath the weight of the great fiddle, they chase the devils out. I think I understand. Huge rocks hang like preaching places. Receding worlds are distantly discerned. The narrow path has vanished into bog, a line erased in rushes. The broad path, too, is puckered, shaled, illusory. There is no summit, only further to go by circuitous ways. I have always known this of mountains, that there are shards in the heather. Yet the breeze is brisk and there is still warmth in the sun. It is August. I taste the blaberries which stain the tongue, so sweet and bitter. I think of you and smile for the beauty of the earth and your face long gone. <laughs>